Life takes energy. That's why Enbridge Gas Distribution is embarking on the largest upgrade to its natural gas delivery system in 20 years. Driven by growth and the need to deliver safe and reliable energy into the future, Enbridge Gas Distribution is adding over 50 kilometers of new natural gas pipeline along with new and upgraded facilities to the current distribution system that serves the region. The planning process for an upgrade of this magnitude involves several stages, including a lengthy regulatory process, a full environmental assessment process and extensive public participation all designed to identify environmental and community features that may be impacted by pipeline construction and operation, so that the impacts can be minimized or avoided. By following these practices, Enbridge Gas Distribution demonstrates its commitment to safety, the community, and the environment. Beginning in the town of Milton, the new pipeline travels northeast within a utility corridor that generally parallels Highway 407 until it reaches an existing Enbridge facility in the City of Toronto. The pipeline begins again in the City of Vaughan at an existing Enbridge facility and continues east, for the most part within the same utility corridor to the City of Markham, where it turns south and continues through another utility corridor to its terminus at Shepherd Avenue East in the City of Toronto. In locating the majority of the new pipeline in existing utility corridors, specifically designated for infrastructure-like pipelines, Enbridge has been able to reduce the impact of construction and operation on the environment and neighboring communities. Naturally, along its length, the GTA project pipeline encounters a range of challenges. The pipeline route crosses seven municipalities and three regions, and along the way, many watercourses, highways, major roadways, and railway corridors. Construction will also take place near known archaeological sites, private developments, hydroelectric transmission lines, parks and recreational areas, homes, businesses, and local schools. These challenges have all been met by the GTA project team through responsible construction planning. And, before construction even begins, the GTA project will have conducted extensive environmental studies and obtained over 400 permits from various approval agencies whose role is to make sure that any potential impact of construction and operation of the new pipeline is temporary or can be mitigated. A major component of design includes the selection of the right construction method for each location. Enbridge Gas Distribution will use a number of different construction methods to install the new pipeline. The first, known as Open Cut, will be the most widely used construction method on the GTA project. It moves at a much faster pace, thus shortening the overall impact. It is also the most cost-effective construction method. There are also several trenchless technologies which are a more specialized approach and employed where there are surface features that must be avoided, such as utility infrastructure, like a hydroelectric tower, a major highway, roadway, railway corridor, or a sensitive environmental feature like a watercourse. They are also used to avoid underground locations due to existing infrastructure or planned infrastructure such as a water main. The most widely used on this project will be horizontal directional drilling or HDD and track bore. In one instance, Enbridge will be utilizing a type of trenchless construction known as direct pipe. Open cut construction installs the pipe in an excavated trench along the pipeline route. During open cut construction, one would see more familiar construction equipment such as a grader to prepare the site, a backhoe to dig the trench, a dump truck to haul away the dirt, and a boom truck to lower the pipe into the trench. HDD installs the pipe in an arc along a predetermined underground tunnel path that is created using a drilling rig. HDD allows the pipe to bypass the particular feature or location below ground. Excavation at ground level occurs only at the entry and exit points, thus reducing the size of the construction footprint. Direct pipe combines the advantages of other trenchless methods like HDD 
but provides for one single continuous working operation that installs the pipe and excavates the required borehole at the same time. There are a number of advantages to direct pipe installation, including speedy installation where timing windows are narrow, such as crossing under a significant and environmentally sensitive watercourse like the Credit River. A track bore, like HDD, tunnels along a predetermined underground tunnel path, again avoiding a particular feature or location. Track bore differs from HDD in that it tunnels with an auger rather than a drilling rig, in a straight line rather than an arc, and over shorter distances. After construction, new pipeline markers are installed to identify the pipeline's location within the permanent pipeline easement. With the exception of trees and shrubs within the easement, wherever possible, the areas impacted by construction are returned to their previous state or better. In most cases, the utility corridors can function just as they did before construction. This is but one of Enbridge Gas Distribution's commitments to the environment and the neighboring communities. At Enbridge, safety is our most important commitment, and it is always top of mind. Safety begins with design. The new pipeline is designed to meet or exceed all applicable pipeline safety standards for operation within the highly urbanized areas of the GTA. Safety is top of mind during construction, when each worksite is strictly monitored to protect the community, workers and the environment, in particular around sensitive areas like schoolyards, parks and playgrounds. Before the pipe is laid in the ground, 100% of the pipe welds are tested using ultrasonic or X-ray inspection technology. Once installed, the pipeline is put in service only after successful hydrostatic testing, which injects water at pressures much higher than the pipeline would normally experience to verify the pipeline's strength and integrity. The Enbridge commitment to safety does not end here. After installation, Enbridge will remotely monitor and control the new pipeline 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, and subject it to regular and thorough maintenance programs. The pipeline in this project will have regular inline inspections, which use robotic tools that run through the pipeline with delicate instruments that record the condition of the pipeline and identify changes and anomalies. Enbridge also actively works with the community and stakeholders to ensure safe practices are adopted around pipelines. This includes promoting the Ontario One Call program, encouraging people to call for utility location prior to digging, as required by law, and improving public awareness along Enbridge vital main corridors. For 165 years, Enbridge Gas Distribution has been serving Ontario customers safely and responsibly. Through the GTA project, Enbridge Gas Distribution can continue that commitment to provide safe and reliable delivery of natural gas, as well as meet the energy needs of an ever-growing customer base and the future demands of the Greater Toronto Area's growing population. Why? Because life takes energy.